it's no matter where we live, what we do for a living, we all want enough to get by. But as prices continue to rise, more people are struggling. Uh, people on the lowest incomes are hit the hardest. And obviously, we're looking to the Bank of England and government who have the responsibility to respond. Um, but today, by raising interest rates, I like to, to be making things worse. You know, it's going to address, not going to do nothing to address the key driver of inflation, which is our over-dependence on fossil fuels and the international gas price. Um, and instead, what it will do is drive up the cost of household debt at a time when we've got record numbers forced into insolvency. Uh, so, you know, these aggressive rate hikes we've seen really threaten people's ability to pay but, their debt. But, but, but a couple of things here. A, they yeah. are independent from government. B, the people on the lowest wages probably wouldn't have mortgages anyway. The, the Bank of England have to do something, wasn't it? Yesterday, I, I mean, I knew this was coming because yesterday we, we heard about the Americans do it, didn't we? I guess you know, the Fed is obviously doing the same thing. Positive Money US is arguing the same as Positive Money UK. This is the wrong. Uh, this is the wrong time to do this. It's not going to address the drivers. You know, uh, Andrew Bailey, the governor of the Bank of England, has has said himself numerous times the Bank of England has no control over um, the energy pricing. So actually, they don't have the tools to to address the high inflation we're seeing. Um, and, you know, you talked about independence. They are operationally independent, yes, of course, but they have their mandate and tools given to them by the government. And unless we get a, a central bank working alongside the Treasury and the wider government to address the, the big economic challenges um, that we face, you know, then we're un unlikely to, to make things better for everyone, no matter which part, which, um, you know, what you do for a living or where you live.